Hello and welcome to Let's Play Serious Sam. I am Clown Skull and I will be commentating this adventure for you as well as uh, playing through it. Uh, this is Serious Sam HD. If you have not played this game, then please buy it. It is great. I recommend it completely uh, for fans of first-person shooters, uh, but not the not the crappy kind, not the realistic kind. That's not what we do here in Serious Sam. Here, what we do is we shoot the crap out of everything that moves. There's no NPCs. There's no there's no cutscenes really. Uh, there's just no big exposition of story, unlike what you're seeing right now. Uh, yeah, I am seeming to be a bit ironic, but uh, look, look at this story. You even reading this? It's not big on the story. There's not a massive plot. You won't be getting plot twists. You won't be getting anything but shooting monsters, really, and secret areas, picking stuff up, killing stuff and picking stuff up. That's all it is. So, uh, yeah, what else could be said about this game? It's, it's, uh, like Doom for the New Age, really. Yeah, how about that? So this is the remake, came out, uh, some ten years after the original, on the new engine that is going to be used for the second sequel, which I hope will be good. It's, uh, I guess what Duke Nukem Forever should have been. A, I guess, a retrospective look at first-person shooters, but in the context of a good old-school shooter in its own right. And I think that's what we're going to be getting, Serious Sam 3. Hopefully. Uh, I'm hopeful that's what we get. Uh, Alright, so... Uh, we're about to start the game, very soon, I promise. There's about 40 seconds of uh, camera panning around this thing in the middle here. Uh, yeah, I mean, this game's great. It's one of my all-time favorites. I've finished it countless times on serious mode, which I ironically again will not be playing uh, because it's mostly it's mostly just reloading the game after you die constantly that's really all serious mode is so I'll be playing on hard today and you're going to have to excuse my uh, sniffing I do have a cold uh, why would I be doing a let's play with a cold who knows alright so this is your big story here I'm not going to try and pronounce the name of the level, but there you go. I'm not going to read this. Let's just... Ready for battle. Let's just shoot things. I like what he thinks. Ready for battle. Alright. Let's go. We'll go this way because I know there's another gun up here. So to spoil it. Uh, whoa, there we go. That's it, folks. The first fight of Serious Sam. You could press F6 to quick save the game. Sounds good to me. Not right now, though. Yeah. Secret weapon. There's our first secret. Our first two creatures of the game that we just killed. Yes, I knew he was there. It doesn't matter. Not... I've played this so many times that nothing can really surprise me anymore. But that's good, that's that's how you know you really like a game, is when you play it a hundred thousand times. So here we go, we've got this uh, we've got this sort of system over in the bottom right there, you can see there's the envelope with the messages. I can in fact bring up a computer screen that you saw a couple of minutes ago that will give me information about everything that I kill, everything that I pick up. Uh, weapon wise and uh, key item wise and it'll also give me information about uh, the level what's coming up what I should expect stuff like that it's a pretty good system I like it and it sort of it gives you a bit of reading to do as sort of a break from all the killing I suppose uh, sometimes it's funny sometimes the jokes fall flat I'm not talking about myself 
I'm talking about the game in general. Uh, it was marketed. I'm gonna go up here where there's more stuff. Uh, it was marketed as funny, I suppose. Well, maybe not marketed that way, but it was definitely clear from the start. Like, look at these guys, they have saw blades for heads. It was definitely clear from the start that this would not be as serious as, ironically, the title pointed out. Uh, I guess that's basically the major, the major, like, uh, joke, I suppose, is that Serious Sam is, in fact, not serious at all. It uh, does not take itself seriously, but it's all the better for it. Uh, we don't care. Why is there a floating vial of pink liquid? I don't care, but it gives me 10 health, so... It, things don't have to make sense in this world. But, uh... So yeah, I don't, I don't want to be saying, Man, that's ironic, every five seconds, but... Uh, another piece of uh, sweet, sweet irony is that the... Uh, Oh, look, I've lost my train of thought. Hmm. That's embarrassing. Well, I'm sure it wasn't going to be any good anyway. Let's forget I said anything, huh? Alright, so there's another secret here. Uh, another thing about this game is the... The secrets... Every... I'm sorry, I, I can't get over how I... How I just... How I forgot what to say after... Oh, I'm so sorry. Uh, let's try and pick it up from here, shall we? These are some big-headed goons that I'm shooting at. Uh, they're only in this level, I believe. Uh, they may reappear in the second encounter. I think they do in a couple of levels. But this is only level in the first encounter in which they appear. And it's sort of an in-joke, really. Uh, yeah, the reason I'm getting all these boring secrets and running around in uh, empty areas is because I want to get all the secrets. Uh, there may be a few secrets which I miss, uh, either because I forget about them or because I never have actually found them. Uh, you have to shoot this with a rocket, by the way. There you go. There you go, Serious Sam, referential humour. Always breaking the fourth wall. Uh, which I suppose uh, the original, well not the original, but Duke Nukem 3D did uh, the breaking the fourth wall, but it did it in a much more uh, subtle manner, I think. <laughs> like anything about that game was subtle, but no, really. Uh, yeah, so once we get through here, once we get through my nightmares, we, uh, with more of them just standing here. What's up with that? Alright, there you go. Sorry, Crow Team, but I've killed you all. Thanks for your game, now I'm gonna murder you. Alright, so, now that we have all this, all this wonderful gear, we're going to walk over, more walking! That's what you wanted, isn't it? Man, this Serious Sam game looks good, I think I might walk for a while. I'm not going to kill anything, I'm just going to walk. Which is pretty funny considering earlier I said that it was all about shooting things. Nope, it's all about walking. Alright, so I'm going to save the game here, get rid of that stupid hint that keeps coming up. You could quick save to save the game. Oh, no joke. Alright, so over these wonderfully uh, chiseled dunes, we're going to come across five of the biggest badasses in the game. Here they are. Uh, they take five rockets to take down. Uh, so long as you don't miss, they take five rockets. See, look at that guy standing up. That guy's good. Uh, you can shoot their rockets in mid-flight which is sometimes why you'll see that your rockets haven't actually landed is because your rockets uh, however impressively can hit their rockets so you see it's like shooting down bullets with bullets 